Hi everyone and welcome to this video where I'll show you how to sort a list in a random order in Excel. In this example we have a bunch of people's first and last names and the last names are currently sorted in alphabetical order. To make our list random we'll first assign each person a random number between 0 and 1. We'll then sort these random numbers from smallest to largest which will in turn randomize the order of the people in our list. To assign each person a random number between 0 and 1, we can use the rand function. So we type equals rand. As you can see, this has assigned Charlotte a random number between 0 and 1, in this case 0 0.439. To bring this formula down to the below cells, we can double click the bottom right hand corner like this. Therefore everyone has been assigned a random number. However, you may have noticed that Charlotte's random number has now changed. This is because Excel recalculates the rand function every time we edit other cells. To stop this from happening, we can copy all of the random numbers by clicking Ctrl C and then right click the selection, select Paste Special and then paste just the values. Since we pasted the values only without the formulae, you'll notice that when we update other cells, our random numbers remain static. Next, we're going to sort these random numbers from smallest to largest, which will randomize the order of the people in our list. To do this, select the random number heading and apply the filter tool, which can be found within the data tab. Then click the arrow and select sort smallest to largest. As you can see, our list is now completely random and no longer in alphabetical order. So that's how you can sort a list in a random order in Excel. To summarize, we started by assigning each person a random number. We then froze the random numbers by using paste special to prevent them from updating. And finally, we sorted the random numbers from smallest to largest to randomize our list. Please give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful and subscribe to the Excel Hub for weekly Excel tutorials, techniques, and examples.